Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of YouTube channel. You're probably wondering, why is camera so shaking? We got a, an actual camera thing, and if you can see the reflection of my eyes, we have a ring light, and there's a microphone right here, but I uh, can't, I, I, oh, I can't use it because um, it requires aux in order to work. Oh, there's the aux right there. I put a thing on it to protect it. Oh, it fell off. But yeah, um, new camera. It's like an actual tripod, too. Like, it has legs and things like that. And it's wobbly right now because I started recording on accident. I was trying to do it. But we're doing a tier list video. I've been wanting to do one of these for a really long time. And I didn't know how to do one. And I watched Corey Kenshin do it earlier today. And I was like, that's it. We're learning how to do a tier list video. So, yep, now we have... Lighting and yes, I know I got a haircut. And this thing else I want to show y'all. My sister gave me this thing. You're probably okay. Chill. Probably wondering. Well, hey, that's like you. No, it's not. And my nail polish is coming off. But this is back when McDonald's didn't care about the. The one problem I have with it is that the legs will not stay still. Will you chill? Might be the uh, the thing up. Maybe it's like the surface that it's laying on. No, because it doesn't stay still on here either. Anyways, yeah. Um, God, I freak. I'm. Whatever, anyways. Well, now you can't see my... This is why I like the other camera stand better. It's made out of freaking Legos. Anyways. Um, it does this. Those are sparks. There is a flint and steel. This is basically a, a Dexter's Laboratory McDonald's flint and steel. You have your flint... And then, well, this is your steel. And then there's a little, I opened it up earlier, there's a little track on the inside. It's like sandstone. There's something on the top, and it, like, bumps up and down. Basically, it's flint and steel. Actually, that was really cool. I mean, you can start a fire with this. And the gun literally is not holding this toward this part right here, the most dangerous part with anything but freaking... Just, you know, two normal freaking screws, flat, uh, not flatheads, you know, but that's not the point. We're already two minutes into, three minutes into this freaking video. Alright. Come on, we have someone of a professional camera stand now. It, the ring light kind of weighs the thing down. Will you freaking stay... I hate this. Can I? Oh, I can do this. Oh, there we go. That works. Okay. Anyways. We're doing a star. We're going to be doing a bunch of different tier lists today. Star Wars will be one of them. I don't think it's going to take that long. All right, the Phantom Menace, first Star Wars movie. Um, that's not the Phantom Menace. Anyway, episode one, Phantom Menace. Um, God, I probably should have watched Star Wars movies before I freaking did this video. Phantom Menace, from what I've heard, really isn't all that good. I had fond memories of it, so we're just gonna put it in a nice and simple B tier. Does it go? Nope. Oh, wait. Like, let's rename these. You're probably thinking, well, why didn't you do a why, uh, why didn't you do a funny joke with this? I, I probably will eventually have a funny joke to do with tier lists. We'll probably come back eventually one day and redo this. Um, yeah. So let's. What was episode two? Clone Attack of the Clones. Um, Attack of the Clones. Pretty unbearable. Like, these movies weren't really all that special. I kind of watched them without really paying attention to them the first time around, so. 
Where's episode... Episode 3. We're putting it in good because of that last final battle. Well, not only because of the last final battle. Anyways. Episode 4, which is actually the first movie out of the whole Star Wars thing. Because these are the prequels. These are the... <laughs> we'll put this in good. Definitely wouldn't watch it again. Uh, simply because... It was whatever. The first movie was okay. I actually rewatched the first movie, uh few, uh, like, maybe two weeks ago, for, um, because I was like, hey, I haven't seen the first movie in a while, why don't I watch, why don't I go through every single Star Wars media on Disney+, Plus, which is almost all of it, except for the EU, um, and, but that, that plan didn't go out very well, I was gonna watch, like, all, uh, Clone Wars, but, whatever, I got to, like, season two, episode, like, 13 or something, um, I don't hate the show or whatever, but you know, blah, blah, blah. um, what will the next one be? Empire Strikes Back? No, that's the last one, right? No, Return of the Jedi is the last one. Empire Strikes Back. Empire Strikes Back. Um, it's it's okay. I watched it. It was just whatever. I am your father. I, uh, Marcus caused my variety hour. So to watch it with the perspective as if you were seeing it for like the first time and I tried but I couldn't do it simply because I just I remembered everything that I already knew uh, Darth Vader is Luke's father Obi-Wan Kenobi's gonna die um all that stuff uh all right so we'll put that there. We'll turn the Jedi. We're also putting this in good simply because um it's whatever. Obviously, epic final battle and all that stuff. It's building technically been building up over six movies if you watch them in chronological order. Uh yeah, it, nothing special, I guess. All right, the Force. Oh, where is the Force Awakens? Oh, we gotta do. I'm doing these in order, which, well, they happened, but I should have put Rogue One before I did the. F I should have put Solo and Rogue One somewhere before I did even these movies. Before I did like these movies. <sighs> Uh, okay, then we'll just, like, pretend that we did. Rogue One, is bearable. It, it, you could have left that plot point of Leia getting the Death Star, well, no, what? When did that happen? You could have left that plot point of, uh, Leia getting the Death Star plans just open for discussion. You didn't have to make a whole movie about it, and the movie itself was not too good. None of the characters were memorable. I remember Jyn Erso and uh, the blind guy and the flamethrower guy. And that was about it. None of the characters were memorable. And yeah, they didn't do a very good job. Um, kind of, they're basically throwaway characters. Like, yeah. Um, Alright, let's solo. I actually didn't watch this one, so we're going to do... We're gonna do that. And for this one we're gonna do did didn't watch. And we're putting solo in that one because I didn't watch it. Um the Force Awakens. We're putting that in. Would we'll watch again, actually. Uh, the Force Awakens is not a bad movie. A lot of people hate on it because Rey's a girl and she's good at things. And it's like, how are you gonna hate on her? It's her first freaking movie. There hasn't been a Star Wars, big Star Wars thing like this in a really long time since freaking Clone Wars. Rebels doesn't count. Rebels is trash. Um. Oh my God. This is. This is. What do I put this in? Bearable or just bad? Put in bad. This movie is so boring and pointless. It's not because Luke dies. It's just it doesn't justify why it exists. Yes, there's an ongoing story that they're building up to, which is to this movie from this from 
to from this one, but it's oh my god, it's just it did the movie was just so boring. Uh, simply because Finn's character was treated like garbage. They didn't want a gay relationship between Poe and Finn, so they just kept giving Finn different love interests. He got, what was it, three, and then Poe got one, and... Yeah, and then they just keep saying to Finn, like, hey, war is bad, he don't like it. But he knows that. Poe is the one who thinks it's fun. He flies his ship around and acts like it's a video game and thinks he's invincible. Also, bombs do not fall in space. Explain that. Explain that BS to me. Next tier list. I think tier list is going to become a new, like, thing on my channel, actually. There's a lot of tier lists on this website. In case you guys are wondering what... The website is called tiermaker.com. Um, this is going to become serious for sure. Like, definitely. Um, yeah, like, they got so many things in here that I... Like, they had... Um, MCU characters, they had food, they had candy, they had fast food, they had cereal, they had video games, movies, Pixar movies. We're, we're, we're definitely doing a series on this. Um, oh, we're obviously going to do a haven't eaten there category. Didn't eat here. All right, Arby's. We have the meats. Burger King. Burger King. Burger King is an A. Their food isn't bad, like everyone says. It's not freaking sawdust. I mean, their nuggets are it's okay, but they're a burger place, not a nugget place. Their burgers are pretty. Whoppers are pretty good. Chocolate balls and burgers. Pause. No homo. You have to say no homo, granddad. Otherwise, use a homo. If you got it'll Caesars. Going in S tier. Don't say it tastes like cardboard because it doesn't. $5 hot and ready. Batman calzone. Batman pocket of cheese and tomato sauce. It's shaped like the Batman emblem. Who doesn't want that? I'm assuming that's... What is that? They did not do a good job making these images. I don't know what this is, can't, so I can't say I ate there. I know Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A is going in a, it's going in eight here. It's not the best food ever. Their shakes are pretty good, though. Chipotle, uh, I've eaten here. Uh, it's gone. Uh, I don't really remember what it was like. Didn't, we're going didn't eat here. Domino's Pizza, we're going, we're going B tier. I like their, uh, uh, uh what is it? C cinnamon... Like, what is it? Cream cheese cinnamon things? Cinnamon knots. Pretty good. Dairy Queen. Definitely going A tier. Yeah. Burt. S Smash Burt Grubhub. Oh, Five Guys. Five Guys. Oh, Five Guys going to be easy. Oh, yeah. Here's where, here's where y'all are going to get. It's in and out Oh, it still says in and out Here's where you guys are going to get mad. In and out, it's going in a B tier with Domino's Pizza. You heard me. Um, I just didn't like it that much. I mean, like, so other people like it. It's freaking Fifty Themes Burger, Fifty Themes Burgers. Which, if you know me really, really well, you know that I enjoy Fifty's culture and lifestyle and things like that. Maybe, maybe I'll just have to eat there again. But la the first time I ate there before I was interested in nineteen fifty culture. Uh. It wasn't the best. Jack in the Box. Their breakfast is pretty good. Put it in A tier. KFC going in the C tier. I'm not black. And I'm not really that big of a fan of fried chicken either. So. McDonald's going in S tier. Big Macs on point. Panda Express going in a D tier. Pandas are my favorite animals. If you couldn't tell. $20. Also, there's some, you know, other mem memorabilia of panels in my room, but, you know, that's the one I had nearest to me. Um, Papa John's going in D tier. I don't, I don't like their pizza. I don't like their double cheese pizza. It is not, it's not good. 
pizza going and die. Don't remember the last time I ate there. I think the last time I ate there was Kellen's birthday party. I think I got a video that I just never uploaded to YouTube. Going in D tier. Actually, you know, we'll put it in C. We'll put it in C tier. We'll put it in KFC in D tier. Popeyes. We'll put it in C tier. Chicken sandwich is okay. I don't think people need to sit, go in and trash the restaurants for it. Sonics. Uh, we'll put that in C. We'll put that in B tier because their their food looks really good in the commercial. If you know what I mean. Uh, their you know their shakes and slushies are pretty. I love their slushies. It's simple. It's just freaking flavored syrup and ice water. It, that's really all it is. Subway. Oh, Subway's definitely going to nest tier. Subway knows how to. That was gonna. That was gonna. That was not gonna sound good. What I was about to say, it wasn't anything bad. It would just you know sound weird. Subway's good. Let's leave it at that. They're, they're simple. It's good. Their cookies are pretty good. Also, Taco Taco Bell. I'm not gonna say the rest of that. Burger King, McDonald's. If you know what that song is, uh, don't at me. Uh, Taco Bell's going to B tier. Mm, yeah, they're going to B tier. Wendy's, we have the meats. Anyways, going to S tier. Wendy's is pretty good. And there we go. There's our fast food tier list. Don't at me. We're going with one of my favorite things in the whole world, candy. And we have some stuff to go through here, so. Alright, we're going to go. Was that? What was that? Oh, just moved. Hey, uh, no, undo it. Un don't do it. No, we got to enter up low. Obviously, we're going to do a didn't eat. Haven't had yet. Haven't had yet. Alright, let's start off with Warheads. Going B tier. The sour doesn't last for that long, and the flavor after it's kind of bad. Actually, we'll put it in C tier. Oh, Rasses Passes. Phone Home ET. Uh. I haven't had them actually. I have a packet in my desk that I use for gags, and there there is Reese's Pieces in there. It's been unopened. I've had it since Halloween. Yeah. Oh, this stuff definitely going in S tier. Definitely going in S tier. One hundred grand. Had it for the first time. Going in. It's going. It's going in B tier. Bazooka bubble gum. Obviously going in A tier. Gobstoppers going in C tier. They don't taste like bull crap. They I just don't like them. Sour Patch Kids is going in A tier. Hot Tamales going in C tier. How many licks did it take to get the center of a B tier? Of a B tier candy. Sweet Tarts, uh, B tier. Orange Slices, haven't had it yet. Fun Dip, uh, going C tier. Jawbreakers going in D tier. Actually, we need to put an F tier. Yeah, y'all can see that really well. That's F tier, basically. What is this? Oh, those little chocolates you get from All Garm? Those are going in S tier. What do you mean? Lifesavers? Uh, the original candy or the gummy ones? Candy, the hard candy's going in B tier. Ring Pops? Going in B tier. A lot of B tier things. Musketeers? D tier. Sorry, Dustin, but I cannot... Unfortunately, I cannot handle a whole Snicker-sized bar of nougat and nothing else. Twizzlers, mm, those are going A tier. Mm, nice and simple. Nothing, nothing to them. Actually, those are going nest tier. Some easy man. I mean, not really, but Jolly Ranchers. They pull my teeth out. A tier. What is that? Assorted Swedish fish. Haven't had yet. Tootsie Rolls going in nest tier. What is that? Uh. Oh, it's, uh, what's it, Mound Bars? They're like the almond chocolate stuff? Coconut? Uh, guns. Into, I guess. 
Candy bracelets haven't had them yet. Razzlers haven't had them yet. Crunch bars going in F tier. Hate the rice can. I hate the rice candy. Pocky. Pocky? Is that Pocky? I don't know what that is. Going in. Haven't had it yet. Kit Kat going in D tier. I'm not a big fan of them. Was it jawbreak? Get back in F tier. There's a bug in here. I'm pretty sure it just flew in front of the camera too. This is gonna be a long video. We're filming a long video. Smarties, uh, D tier, not the uh, York Patties, C tier. Uh, dots going in S tier. I love them. Love them so much. Don't care they get stuck in my teeth. They're really yummy. I, well, um, <laughs> there was a picture on my old Snapchat where I had bitten a bunch of dots in half and put them to the box and stuck them to the box. <laughs> I did something similar with gummy bears, but it wasn't the box. No, it, no, it, no, it wasn't, uh, no, it was my arm, I promise. I promise. I'm worried I'm going to break my computer. I'm worried this computer is going to break one day, like this monitor is just going to split in half. Peeps going in F tier. I don't like them. I haven't had it yet. Starburst going in A tier. R Rat Reese's Cups. Reese's Puffs. Reese's Puffs going to B tier. Going in C tier. Gushers going in S tier. Where else would they go? Lemonheads going in A tier. Love them. Not the best airheads also going in. No, get no going in A tier. Dum Dums going in going in S tier. Wish they were bigger, but you know whatever. Hershey's going in A tier. I love them, but they're too small. Sour Patch. Watermelon. Oh, those are going in S tier. Those are going in S tier. Snickers, B tier, average chocolate candy. I've gotten tired of Twix. I liked them for a while. I just got tired of them. Nerds going in freaking D tier. They're so simple. I hate them. Milk Duds going in A tier. Not my favorite, but pretty, pretty tasty. Fireball? Nope. I think I've. Are those those little tahini balls? Oh, they, I think. I'm gonna go out of the assumption those are those little like chamoy tahini things. So we're gonna. Put those in A tier. Milky Way, it's freaking C tier. It's your average. I'm putting these in C tier. Just average candy bar. Uh, Blow Pops going in B tier. Not the greatest thing ever, but they're not meant to be. Uh, are those Gummy Life? Oh, these are the Gummy Life Savers. Where are they? I think those are the gummy ones. These are the hard ones. Put them here. Uh, Pez? Mm, freaking D tier. Pop Rocks, D tier. Too noisy. What is that? Grandma's dementia pills? I haven't had them yet. Mike and Ike's going in S tier. Don't care. Don't at me. M and M's going in, going in, C, going in C tier. It's just freaking chocolate inside of a shell. Uh oh, jelly beans going in B tier. Just depends on what company it is. Whoppers going in C tier. Oh, can I not? Oh, okay. I can't put them in C tier. Okay. Uh, nothing special. Ooh, are those those little gimme the going in B tier. Pretty tasty, though. I like I like liquid. Not pee pee. Pee pee's gross. Tastes like it doesn't taste it does not taste like lemonade. You might think it does, but it does not. Skittitalis. Um going in C tier. Not the greatest thing ever. You eat too many of them, they just start to get gross. Heath! You're going you're going in D tier, Heath. Alright. Laffy Taffy going in A tier. Love I love me some Laffy Taffy. Skittles again. I what did I tell you? Stay in the C tier where you belong. We don't serve your kind here. Okay, I'm getting demonetized. Don't at me. Why do I keep saying don't at me? I'm I don't I can't blurt that out either. Don't watch don't I promise you it's not intended to be racist. It may sound like it, but it's not. Gummy bears going in. Going in. Oh, frick. Hold on. S tier. Where else would they go? Baby Ruth. C tier. Your average candy bar. Candy corn going in A tier. Don't know where else it would go. Almond poop going in F tier. Going in C tier. Not the greatest candy ever, but it's okay. What is that? Grandma's dementia pills again. Oh, those fruity poop. Medicine vitamins they have to take. Uh, uh, going D tier. Ooh, Pixie Stick going in C tier. No, going in B tier because the freaking paper. I'm glad you're trying to save the turtles though. 
Just a regular Hershey's bar going in A tier. Nice and simple. Nothing to it. Alright, there we go. Next one, and probably our last one. Alright, we're doing cereal. Something I eat every... <coughs> that was loud. <coughs> Something I eat almost every day. Pretty yummy. Hurts my the roof of my mouth sometimes. Cheerios! Cheerios! Don't know what kind of these are green. I don't... Freaking vegan Cheerios. Cookie crisp, don't want a D tier. Not cookie enough, not crisp enough. Actually, no, it's, it's a good amount of crisp. What the frick even is that? I don't even know what that is. It's a rock. Oh. I want to play the song here, but screw it. Anyways, enough of that. That joke was really lazy. Go in and haven't had it yet. Did not have here, just I haven't had it yet. Uh, also haven't had it yet. No, no, you stay in D tier, haven't had you yet. Apple Jacks, go in B tier. Cinemon. God, we were like absolutely dying in PE class because like we were like, it's a freaking, it's a Jamaican cinnamon, it's a Jamaican skateboarding cinnamon stick and we were just dying over that. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Um, items did what was it, the food mask? I think it beat up tier list. Oh, that was funny. Maybe we'll do that video eventually. All right, corn flakes. I haven't had you yet. I've had corn. I've had you know frosted flakes. I've had Turetzka cereal. I haven't had Count Chocula. I'm not the white, unfortunately. Captain Crunch. Uh, these are not the Captain Crunch I had. So I technically haven't had it yet. Rice checks going in C tier. They don't like the basic flavor. Alright, we gotta... This guy, this is almost 30 minutes long. I think this is the one I had. This is going in F tier. It's like for, it's like Reese's Puffs, but it's much harder to chew. Uh, I haven't had these yet. God, this is a lot of, I haven't had these yet. Yes, I have. I'm going D tier. So, going in S tier for sure. I haven't had these yet. Actually, no, I have had these. These are going B tier. Cheerios going in A tier. Don't know where else they go. Going in A tier. They hurt my teeth too much to be in S tier. Haven't had these yet. Cheery regular Cheerios. Put my pee pee in the Cheerios. We're not singing that song on here though. I hate I hate I hate that guy. Um Haven't had these yet. I don't know why I skipped all the way to the bottom. Haven't had these yet. Lucky Charms going in B tier. Fruit Loops going in A tier. Raisin Bran going in. It's just freaking Frosted Flakes with Raisins. Golden Crisp. I haven't had these yet. Fruity Pebbles going in A tier. Love it when... Oh, Cocoa Puffs going in A tier. Oh, Frosted Flakes going in A tier. No, this is... Yeah, Cocoa Puffs going in S tier. Captain Crunch going in freaking F tier. I haven't had those ones yet. I haven't had it yet. Friggin' Raisin Man again. Honeycomb going it's C tier. Not the best tricks. Going in S tier. Unfortunately, I cannot have them anymore because I'm not a kid. <sighs> not again. <sighs> going in C tier. No, blah, blah, blah. Coco Pop going in S tier. Yeah, baby. That's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. Woo! That's no. I don't care if that's your opinion. You look like that. Anyways. Final tier list. I mean, light. How's my lighting? Do I care? We're, no, because we're cool, so we do this. Basic, uh, yeah, that'll be the tier list. Let me know, let me guys know if y'all want another tier list video. Uh, kind of enjoyed making this one. Didn't go for the funnies like I, like I usually do. Um, I'm kind of tired, actually. Uh, it's about, uh, it's about 10, it's, yeah, it's like, t it's like, uh, 10 p.m., I say, oh, that's how baby time to fall asleep. Well, if I go to sleep before then, then my, then I get, I uh, get diseases, so. But yeah, I ate Reese's Puffs over this morning. My freaking, the top of my mouth actually still hurts. And I ate breakfast 
12 hours ago. I'm turning this off. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. But, yeah, we're... How do I look in different lights? Devin and... How he looks in different lights. Okay. Here's red. Green. Blue. Pink. Yellow. Dark yellow. Pink again. And red. Again. And then here's regular white. I look like Voldemort. Harry. Uh, uh, I didn't, I didn't watch Harry Potter. I'm not going to. I don't like it. There's a the weird talking hat. It has the weird dudes with the beards. And it, ha it, just, it has the snakes. And it has that dude. And he has no nose. And you got the other dude with the black hair. And you got, uh, what was it? Uh, dragon tinfoil? Something like that. Um... Not the point, though. Basically, let me guys know. Okay, it's way too loud. Let me guys know if you want to see another one of these videos. I did enjoy making this video, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe if you like to come true, this man. Uh.